Now, hospital officials say that ICUs are at or near full capacity and more patients could be transferred around the hospital system. ABC4 News investigator Jason Wynn caught up with a doctor at U of U Health who warned us two weeks ago of deaths in the double digits. Tonight, she has a new warning. We're still pretty stressed. Doctors and nurses are suffering from COVID fatigue. The days that are really hard are when we see multiple deaths, when we see multiple admissions. 17 deaths is a lot. In that, if this is the beginning, could be a very dark and sad winter for all of us. Doctors believe the surge of COVID-19 cases we are seeing is directly related to schools reopening. I think we are seeing some deaths from that now. In dire need of space, the hospital opened up additional ICU beds, and doctors tell me they're still at 99% capacity. The night we did that, we admitted 10 non-COVID ICU patients. So there's still those people who need our level of care. Medical professionals fear Utahns may continue getting together leading into the holidays. And they still feel unsupported because we've seen our case counts just surging. And then we see things like parties in Utah County and that makes us feel as though we're not valued. With the seven-day rolling average of COVID-19 quickly approaching 20 percent and two Utah nurses who have died from the virus, medical professionals worry about their safety. We cannot exhaust our nurses or we will not be able to take care of anyone. I'm Jason Wynn, ABC4 News. Thank you, Jason. Dr. Graves also urged all of us to wear masks and to not gather with anyone you do not live with.